fan movies and TV shows that change fashion forever. Welcome to Luxify, we talk about fashion, luxury and basically all the best things life has to offer. Welcome to our video listing 10 movies and TV shows that change fashion forever. There are two things we can count on in life for easy everyday escapism, television and fashion. And when the two come together, it is one of our favorite things. There is no denying movies and series have great impact on fashion and on the way we dress. While some simply mirror the style of the time, others are trendsetters and can influence whole generations and the fashion industry. Movies and TV shows are not only distractions, they are also culture and can heavily impact our day-to-day -day life even if we don't notice. I bet there are a few fashion items you didn't know were made popular this way, like the Ray-Bans Tom Cruise wore on Risky Business, for example. Here I'll show you 10 movies and TV shows that had a big impact on fashion and that changed the way people dress. At the end of the video, we have a bonus fact that may surprise you. So without further ado, here are 10 movies and TV shows that changed fashion forever. If you are new here, welcome! Please subscribe and follow us on Instagram at Luxicom. Number 10. Flashdance Perhaps the most famous 80s movie, it not only brought us one of the most iconic soundtracks of all time, but it also changed the way people dressed at the time. Jennifer Bills plays Alex, a Pittsburgh welder with an ambition to dance ballet, and her off-the-shoulder look was wildly popular in the 80s. Bills herself is responsible for the look, she told Times Magazine. When I was in high school, I had a favorite sweatshirt that had remained in the dryer for too long, so the hole for my head was too small, I couldn't get my head through, so I cut around the hole. I wore it to one of the auditions and they liked it. When Flashdance became a box office hit, gyms were filled with women wearing the off-the-shoulder look, and even non-athletic clothes were affected by this trend. For years, the off-the-shoulder was a trend supported by everyone, and today it is synonymous with the classic 80s look. Number 9. Fresh Prince of Bel-Air Basically, everyone on this show was a style icon. From Will that rocked the best street style, to Dorky Carlton that was a symbol of prep chic and the teen style of Ashley, that is still emulated by girls everywhere. But let's not forget the fashion highlight of the show, Hilary Banks. Her outfits featured 90s inspired color blocking that was trendy and upscale. This show is credited with having made street style mainstream. Number 8. The Great Gatsby this movie didn't impact everyday dressing so much, but if we take a look at theme parties and red carpets of the 2010s, then we can see the influence. Elegant art deco dressing from the Roaring Twenties came back to red carpets and gala events. Low waistlines, fringe dresses and well-tailored suits represented the decadent wardrobe of the movie. The costumes of the movie were designed by Mucha Prada and Catherine Martin, and wasn't an exact representation of the 20s fashion, but rather the 21st century vision of that time. That is why it was so popular. Number 7. Bonnie and Clyde Warren Beatty and Faye Dunaway magnetically played one of the most notorious criminal couples in history, Clyde Barrow and Bonnie Parker. The movie portrays the crime spree of the duo, and while the real Bonnie was not known for her fashion choices, the fictional Bonnie had a wardrobe upgrade. The character was portrayed with stylish 30s outfits, and most importantly, a beret. Faye Dunaway wearing a stylish beret in the movie was a fashion game changer at the time. Audiences were so infatuated with the actress's performance that they began purchasing berets in record numbers. According to The Herald, the production of berets in France more than doubled after the success of the movie. Number 6. Gossip Girl This show about a pack of self-indulgent, self-obsessed, wealthy teens from the Upper East Side is definitely a favorite. This show influenced a whole generation of girls and made high fashion popular among them. With Serena being the cool boho girl sporting Chloe, Mulberry and Celine, and Blair representing the preppy style, with Chanel, Dior and Louis Vuitton. 
one of the most influential series of the 2000s and 2010s, the show made its take on Preppy or Bird's side one of the biggest trends of the decade. A couple episodes in, and you realize why Blair Waldorf and Serena van der Woodsen continue to be style icons to this day. Not everyone wants to be Blair Waldorf, but again, not everyone can be. If you are enjoying this video so far, please subscribe to my channel, so I can continue to bring you the best content about fashion and luxury living. Number 5. Annie Hall Woody Allen's Annie Hall is the definitive romantic comedy of the 1970s. Annie Hall, played by Diane Keaton, made androgynous style a thing. It represented her nonconformism and the fact that she was a modern woman. The wardrobe was supplied by iconic fashion designer Ralph Lauren, but it was Keaton who put the outfits together. Lauren said, Annie's style was Diane's style, very eclectic, oversized jackets and vests, floppy men's hats and cowboy boots. We shared a sensibility, but she had a style that was all her own. Annie Hall was pure Diane Keaton. After this movie, women all over the world got inspired to experiment with ties, pants, vests, hats, and mix and match whatever they liked. Number 4. The Devil Wears Prada No list talking about movies and fashion would be complete without The Devil Wears Prada. Based on a novel written by Anna Winters, former personal assistant, this is perhaps the most iconic fashion movie to date. During its production, more than $1 million was spent on the wardrobe for the cast. This movie has made a lasting impact on popular culture, with Winter saying in an interview that anything that makes fashion entertaining and glamorous and interesting is wonderful for the industry. Fun fact, Anna Winter attended the premiere of the movie wearing Prada, of course. Number 3. Clueless Clueless set a standard for what 90s dressing should look like. The plaid skirt suit and mini dresses worn by Cher, Dion's bow hat and Ty's pre-makeover schoolgirl look are still iconic and have endured the test of time. Teen girls were emulating the look instantly after the release of the movie, and it is just as relevant to fashion today, with all the 90s fashion trends coming back. And this movie also gave us one of the most iconic fashion scenes ever captured in movie. Cher refusing to get on the ground while being robbed at gunpoint because, after all, it was a liar. Number 2. Sex and the City No fashion sitcom is more iconic than Sex and the City. During its run, Sex and the City featured so many unique ways of styling clothing, from mismatched shoes to belts over bare midriffs. And of course, the main stars of the show each had their own distinctive style, befitting of their careers, relationship trajectories, and personalities. Carrie Bradshaw made Manolo Blahnik become a household name, and made the Fendi Baguette be an iconic cult status bag. The impact this show had on fashion is undeniable. And as I recorded this video, I couldn't help but wonder, do I actually have a style, or do I simply copy every outfit from Sex and the City? Number 1. Breakfast at Tiffany's Audrey Hepburn and Tiffany, name a more iconic duo. Fashion-wise, this is the most iconic movie ever. Not only did it bring huge popularity to Tiffany's that was slumping after World War II, but it also made the little black dress the fashion staple that it is today. The LBD was created by Coco Chanel in the 1920s, but it was only truly made popular when Audrey Hepburn wore this given she won while eating breakfast at Tiffany's. And of course, there is the famous pajama with the eye mask, just as iconic today as it was 60 years ago. Let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite. Comment below which brands you would like to know more about. And for sticking with us this far, here is some bonus information. Marilyn Monroe's dress was sold for almost $5 million. There are iconic dresses, and then there is Marilyn Monroe's pleated white dress that she wore in the 1955 film The Seven Year Itch. This dress became immortalized in film history, with the image of a Monroe standing above a subway grate with the dress blowing upwards, becoming one of the most famous pictures of the 20th century. 
The dress was designed by William Travilla, a costume designer, and was sold at an auction in LA for $4.6 million in 2011. Thank you for spending some time with us, and make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss a video. In return, I'll provide you with the best content about fashion, travel, and luxury living. See you soon!